Hello folks, it's Clint here from Southern Style Homestead. You're looking at a patch of not real good little corn. There's two or three little rows of it there. And you can see right about the white barrel down there where the corn changes. I'll zoom in just a little bit. This is some sorry, sorry land right here. Stays wet most of the time. The corn was approximately that tall right there. And I fertilized this piece of it with one five gallon bucket of chicken litter out of one of my chicken pens. There's some little sunflowers in there. You can see how tall that one is. There's one fell over. There's another one right there that you just barely can see. This never growed another inch. This here grew up and done a little better. That's just to show you just what chicken litter will do for corn or anything in the garden. If I'd have put chicken litter down real good and plowed it in before I planted corn, I would have probably had a really good crop of corn. And like I said, this ground soured. It stays wet. It's just nasty dirt. This is what it would grow with nothing. And right there, it about waist high. This had five gallons of chicken litter put on it, and that's about 40 foot a row. And it's actually got a few little ears of corn on it. I just thought that was a great little experiment to do. To just save nothing versus a little chicken litter. Uh, I try not to use any kind of commercial fertilizer. I mean, I've got, that's what's left of my garden there. You can see that corn, okra, beans, stuff's growing down there. It does real well, but I fertilize it every fall with chicken litter. Let it overwinter in the ground then plant next spring. Works real well. I quit wasting my money on chemical fertilizers some years ago. I hope everybody can learn something from this and I hope everybody has a good day.